Hi, everyone, and welcome to the CompTIA A plus 220-1001, Module 1, Lesson 1.3, Post, The Power On Self-Test. I am your instructor, Bill Price. Our learning objectives for this lesson are to understand what is the power on self-test, understand beep codes and what codes are covered on the CompTIA A+, identify text errors in the boot process, understand what is a postcard. Post, the power on self-test. What is post? When the system unit is powered on, the CPO checks throughout the motherboard and verifies that the peripherals and other hardware connected to the motherboard are in good working order. If any other hardware is not in working order or is not detected, an error message is displayed on the screen. Now, POST works before the motherboard's video card is activated, and it is the first thing you see once the video is activated. It works before and during the boot process. Now, think about this. If POST works before the video card is activated, what happens when trouble is detected before the video is activated and working? Beep codes, that's where they come in. Beep codes are patterns of beeps used by the BIOS to indicate a serious or fatal error to the end user. A pattern of beeps may be a variable of numbers of short beeps or a mixture of long and short beeps. This is dependent on the motherboard and stored. Check your motherboard manufacturer's manual. Beep codes are used when an error occurs before the system video has been initialized. Beep codes will be generated by the system board speaker, commonly referred to as the PC speaker. Now let's look at a series or examples of beep codes. The long continuous beep tone indicates a memory failure. No beep, power supply could be bad, system not plugged in, or the power not turned on. Other indicators as far as if it's no beep, if everything seems to be functioning correctly, there may be a problem with the beeper itself. The system would normally beep one short beep. Another code to be aware of is the one long, two short beeps. This indicates a video card failure. In modern day motherboards, these two, the one long, two short beeps, indicating the video card failure, and the long continuous beep tone indicating the memory failure are more of the two common ones and the only two that you would have to worry about in the new modern motherboards. Now, when is a beep code not a beep code? At the end of a successful post, the system unit will produce one or two short beeps. These are just to inform you that all is well and everything powered up correctly. So let's move on to post text errors. After, video, after the video has tested OK and is activated, post errors will display on the screen. Under normal circumstances, the text error will be self-explanatory. The text errors are by far more useful than the beep codes because they tell you what the problem is in plain English. Here's an example of a post text error that you may have seen before. You can see that the text error message is reporting that a CPU fan error has occurred. Postcards. Let's talk about postcards. Postcards are devices that's used to monitor the uh, post process. So what happens when you have a device that is not functioning so much that it disrupts the post process and causes the system to con continuously loop? This will most likely cause the system to appear as if it was dead. Since video has not activated and nothing is appearing on the screen. Worse yet, there are no beep codes to tell you what is wrong. What do you do? You use a postcard and that's where they come in handy. So like I said before, postcards monitor the post process and identify which hardware piece is having issues. Postcards are simple cards that snap into expansion slots on your system. A small two character lit emitted diode or an LED 
A row readout on the card indicates which device in the post is currently testing. And again, check your motherboard manual for postcode error definitions. Okay, we've covered a lot of topics, so let's review. Post the power on self test. When the system unit is powered on, the CPU checks throughout the motherboard and verifies that the peripherals and other hardware connected to the motherboard are working. Beep codes. Beep codes are patterns of beeps used by the BIOS to indicate a serious or fatal error to the end user. Postcards. Postcards are simple cards that snap into the expansion slots on your system. A small two-character lit emitted diode or an LED readout on the card indicates which device the post is currently testing. Okay, another great start. You've got a good jump on the a exam in learning what the post power on self-test was, beep codes, and a handy tool called the postcard. That's all of our learning for today. I will see you in the next lesson.